Hello everyone, Mr. Merkic here and today I'm bringing you part 2 of how to make a Skype tool and today what I'm going to be doing is adding Skype mood editing, Skype name editing, mass messaging and online status. Um, but before I start, I just want to let you know that if you could come and use Black Caps, wherever this is, uh, it's my website, I told you before about it but I know I wanted to get it, I want to get it active and start getting people on here coming and releasing stuff and stuff like that. Uh, so yeah, if you do come on here, I'll appreciate it. So if you could come on and sign up, maybe post, release stuff, yeah, that would be nice. And so yeah, let's just get into the video. Um, so like I said, we're going to be the stuff we're adding uh, before I start coding. We're just going to do the design of things. Uh, for some reason the properties are gone. There we go. So I'm just going to rename this to profile and in here let's add a few things now I'm going to be using group boxes because I think they look pretty neat uh, so you just if you want to copy me just go ahead and grab his group box uh, so I'm going to call this mood uh, Skype mood and inside Skype mood we're going to have a text box and a button uh, let's find a button. Just drag that like that. Oops, maybe make this a little bigger. And the button, just drag the button along with it. Shrink that down. Uh, so I'm gonna copy this whole thing. Put this. Oops. Drag that down there. And let's copy it one more time. Put that here. We'll rename this one to Mass Message and we'll rename this one to Skype Name. Uh, so let's set the buttons. Set this to Set, set Mood. If I can spell that. Uh, send Message and we'll put this one to set name uh, don't, I'm not going to bother too much about the capitals there uh, so let's just uh, one more thing actually that I was going to show you let's get a, if we get a combo box uh, before I get that I need another group box this group box here size that down and drag the combo box in uh, let me just copy this button that in there. Rename this group box to online status and set this button to set status. There we go. Uh, so we've got four things. This is what we're going to be doing today. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. Uh, for, the, so for the mood, we just want to double click the mood button and inside here how we set the mood is we use Skype, the thing that we set in um, part one, dot, and we want to get the current user profile, so the profile that's connected to the tool, uh, dot mood text, and that is going to be equals to, let me check, text box one, so equals to text box one dot text. Uh, so that is that. That is literally all it is for setting the mood. And the Skype name isn't too much of a difference. It is Skype dot current user profile dot full name, and that is equal to text box two dot text. And just to make sure it's text box two, I think it is. But let's check. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that is mood and name already done. That's as you can see, that is easy to do. Um, but these two is where they get a little bit more complicated so mass message basically we want to use a um, because it's mass message we want to get every contact in the Skype friends list how we do this we go for each uh, user 
as Skype or com dot lib dot user dot no not dot sorry in Skype dot friends. So that will get every user in the friends list connected to the Skype tool and basically what we want to do in for now is Skype dot send message and inside the message or we have to select we have to tell it what the message is going to so we just want to use user because uh, that is uh, each user on the friends list and then for the message it's going to be text box I believe it was free dot text let's just double check that Set to three, yeah. So that's going to send it to each user in the friends, and then it's going to send it what we entered. Uh, so that's that for that. And for online status, what we need to do in the combo box is you press the little arrow facing right here, and press edit items. Uh, we can add in the options for this combo box. Uh, I won't show you how to do all of them, I'll just show you how to do one or maybe two. So I'll just show you how to do online and offline. You obviously you can add all the way and like away, do not disturb. But I'll just show you these two. So press OK. And then what we want to do is double click set status. And basically what we need to do is get the input from the combo box. So how we do this is if combo box one dot selected items. and that is equal to the name that you inputted so we inputted online we'll do online first then so if it is oops seems to have an error one second so that's selected items no apparently online's an error one second anyway uh, we would do skype dot current user status and that is equal to skype uh, for com lib dot t user status dot cos online so that is setting it online and so then after the end if we would basically do the same again if combo box one dot selected item is equal to off offline now the other option then uh, skype dot current user prof uh, status sorry current user status is equal to skype uh, so basically it's give it is for us we want that one so for some reason we we're getting an error on this second let me just check down in the properties if I can find it find it hang on if it will load I don't know if it will debug yeah no uh, one second let me just comment this line out Oops, what am I doing? Nope, apparently there's still errors. Let me just take away all this. Let's actually see if there's... Yeah, so they're there. I don't know why it's doing that. Anyway, I'll sort that out. See, let's connect to Skype. Uh, so, as you can see, my mood is black caps. Um, where's the tool at? We come 
to mood and type uh, test set mood there we go my mood changed Skype name test that changed as well so I'll post the fix for that in the description uh, when I saw that out and I'll see you next time